But I'm like, you can't dig through the register, bro. That no, is shady that is as literal, crap. Yeah, that's not, that's no I'm like, bueno. I'm like, you're literally going to have loss prevention here tomorrow if you keep doing this. Oy vey, uh, people. And so he's like, yeah, Janelle, you know, she kind of got really quiet. And I was like, I'm, I'm over today. And thing sucks. I want to go home. I want to sleep. I do not want to be here. You want to co-host right Smells Like 90s Rock. And thing like, sucks. I hate having to close with them. Yeah. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Not to mention just on a Friday because Friday nights, normally, there's a few Friday nights that are not like this, but normally we get everything done mm -hmm. super early. Mm -hmm. So the rest of the night is just doing nothing. Right. Which, I mean, grant you, my certification is due again, so I was doing some continuing education for it. Right. But... And then because of that, uh, a pharmacist who's very misogynistic was all up in my personal bubble mm -mm. reading my questions like, well, let me help you answer. I'm like, you can read them from afar. You don't need you can, to be you can next just, to me. Yeah, like, hey, it's pork loose tonight. Like, no. <laughs> oh, no, he's not loose tonight? Or? I don't know. <laughs> Whatever, like, yeah. I just, I was so, so ready to go. I know. I know. It's been a day. I it's just, day. I just, you had a rough one. I just had an annoying one. And I just wanted to come home and cuddle you. And that's all that we needed. And you didn't even want cuddles because you don't like cuddles when you have bad day. I have a, when I, I like, no, I don't, I do not like humans after I have a bad day and I need humans to stay far away from me. Yeah. And I'm the opposite. I want cuddles. I know. But I can, I can give you, I can. Thank you. I, 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 I'm more than happy to hold you and make you feel better. Yeah. During all of that. We I know. We share a little bit. We do we, a few minutes of cuddles and then, okay. Done. That's, that's, it's like Teebs when she's with us. Like, yeah. Good. That's just a few minutes and we're good. But I just, they mentally broke me today. Yeah. I know. And you were mentally broken today. Yes. We need this weekend to just recover. And the first hour of Smells Like 90s Rock has broken, so stand by. Big Orange and proud of it. We are WUTK 90.3 FM, Knoxville, Tennessee, home of the Tennessee Volunteers. Do you like my segues? I'm, I'm trying to do more segues when we do the uh, the legal ID. I did one last week, too, with pork. It was pretty badass, and now I'm what, pretty... Was it badass? Yeah, it was. Uh, it's like... Eh. I, remember, I can't remember what we were talking about, but I said... You know, we, 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 we try to do, he was like, we try to do this, but I don't know. And I said, you know what? I am going to do this. And I hit the thing. Oh, it's great. Badass, baby. And Badass. Then I just, uh, did it tonight, too. What? Those words I told you, can I say them on, on the air? I, I'd rather we not Kay. go that far. That's, that's why I didn't say Yeah, that. thanks. I mean, we, we uh, you know, I can say things, well, no, I'm not going to go that I know I can't say the S word because I love to say that. That's that one or the F word, no we can't say those. You can say damn. Okay. You can say hell. Well, damn. I just said badass. So, I mean, you know, you can do things like that. But don't get carried away with it. That's the thing. Gotcha. I'm just curious. Wanko Rotary Engine. FCC's coming for us now. Hope you're ready for that. Okay. All right. Um, <laughs> no. But, yeah, like, see, here's the thing. Baby J and I have pretty much, this week has pretty much drained our, <sighs> any hope for humanity this week. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. I spoke to so many buttheads on my job. I, oh, this is, I have another thing that I didn't tell you that really bad happened the other day. I don't happened? think I did. What? A guy spit on Mo. Oh, no, you did tell me about that. I did that. tell you that. Okay. You did tell me that. Yeah. No, so long story short, uh, something about prescription the uh, for a woman. Her, her, her husband comes to the drive through uh, and spits at her pharmacy. The guy that was supposed to be here tonight, Mo. I wish yeah. he was here so he could tell the story. Liter I so literally, because we opened at 8. Mm-hmm. 815 this woman calls me and is yelling at me on the phone how yeah. we're not giving her prescription how she needed a prior authorization and we were withholding it and i'm like if it needed a prior off call I, me i'm not withholding it from yeah. you you can have it you just have to pay the cash price for it right um it, come to find out you know we had gotten the prior off and it was ready for her and i guess the system the automated system which i don't control uh did not alert her and so she did not know it was sitting there and she was yelling at me. And I'm like, well, it's here. And she was basically told me, she's like, okay, well, I'm going to come get it. And then I want you to transfer my prescriptions to another pharmacy. Cool. Whatever. I don't care. Then Hang the up. husband comes Hang up through phone. the About an hour later, yeah. husband comes through drive through Thank God it was through drive through because yeah. Mo might have thrown hands if it wasn't. Yeah. Mo opens the window and like before he can even like say anything, the dude spits at him. Mm-hmm. 
And I wonder if that wasn't racially motivated, too. I mean, probably. Because Mo, Mo is short for Mohammed. He, he, he is Egyptian. He is Egyptian. So, so you know. Um, to which the guy tried to back it up saying, oh, I didn't spit on you. I was spitting in the little, because you like the, yeah, between boy. the car and the drive through window. Bull. And he's like, no, you literally hit, like, the glass on the window. So yeah. it didn't necessarily hit Mo, but it was directed at him. And there were cuss words thrown. Lots of those f bombs were dropped. Words we can't um, say here. Words we cannot say here. And uh, thanks. Um, basically, he's like, "Well, I am, you know, cutting you off from this pharmacy. You are not filling here anymore. Don't even think about filling here anymore." Like threw his medicine at him, and then he said, "Have a great f and day," and shut the window in his face because, I mean, like what. What else are you like, going to do in that He was situation? like, if you stay here and you try to do anything, I will call the cops on you. Have you arrested for trespassing and assault? Yeah. So get out of here. Good for him. Listen, good for That Mo. other I pharmacy called to get that dude's wife's prescription. And Mo told him exactly what happened and said, Godspeed, you know, good God, luck. You enjoy that. And the That's lady, all you. The lady who took him, the pharmacist who took him, was like, I wouldn't have been able to handle that. Like no. I would have got in his face, and Mo was like, "Well, he came through drive-through, so that's what saved." That's him. that's what saved the day here. Literally, folks. what saved the day. But uh -huh. it, it it literally just made me be like, "WTF is wrong with people?" Yeah. Like, what has this world come to that we feel like we are so entitled and so just like can do whatever we want that that seems okay?